welcome back to the finishing of the Blue Mosque. And uh, so I'm jumping right into this. And the first very beginning part of this right here, I realize I can't do inking on an angle. The brush pen that I'm using right there, which I am enjoying, is not a pen that's really conducive for writing at an angle. And um, I'll be honest, I'm not really sure if it is the best pen for this type of painting. I did use it in another painting that's available on my Etsy shop, or you can contact me for prints for. That was of Prescott, uh, the Prescott Courthouse. I did two of those paintings, and I used this pen to ink those. Now, I decided to ink this because I wanted to clean up those edges. Um, since there's so much gray and so much grayscale in this particular picture, I thought adding the black lines would be helpful. Some artists, some professional artists, from what I understand, think that this is cheating. I don't. Uh, I, I'm happy to say that my skills improved where I can do a painting like Hagia Sophia and I don't put lines in and I think it looks great. But I also, I like what the ink brings. So over the course of the last video, I talked about how our lives kind of intermingle, but you know, sometimes you need those things to set some boundaries or you need to uh, let certain areas of your life just kind of pop out. And that's what inking a painting does for me. Now, I do want to make note here that if you would like to purchase uh, one of these prints, I am working on getting them, and they're probably up by this point on my Redbubble shop. You can order from there, or you can send me a message and contact me for prints. The original will be for sale. I guess if you want the original, I will uh, sell it to you, but you have to contact me about prices and all that. Um, I've been doing that and as a way in part to have people enjoy what I do, but also to, you know, Hey, make a couple bucks. Why not? You right. So here with this painting, you'll notice uh, doing the inking kind of helps things to pull together a little bit. And I did make a choice here where I started to use a finer tip pen because this again is a winter scene, and there are trees all along this edge here that are not, you know they don't have leaves so you know they need you need to put the branches out and then I went back to the brush pen because I wanted some thicker lines the the other pen I thought was just a little too faint so I'm glad that you could be with me on this journey uh, down memory lane of my trip to Turkey to both Hagia Sophia and the Blue Mosque and personally I'm really proud of how this came out in fact I plan on doing a little print of maybe like half sheet size of the two of them that I can put together in one frame just for myself. This is always my favorite part, pulling off the tape at the end. You see that nice crisp edge. So thank you for joining me on this journey and stay safe.